How much would it cost to recruit you? Knight? What? Uh, oh, it costs eight. Okay. So I could recruit them for eight, and then it's 15 for the sun prod, and then another five for the electrical protection gloves. So that's 28 I would require to be able to pull this stuff off. That's pretty ridiculous. We're not going to be doing that. Yep, we will save our tickets for something else in D. Um, what kind of purchases can we make? Here. So this... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you pick these swords up, you lose your other rolls. So that's not fun. Um... An Academy Master could be good, though, in, in favor of my of my pet. Dropping the pet for an Academy Master. They also got a lot of blue, which I don't have very much of. Um, how much do you cost? Cost eight. I think, I think that's what I'll do. Are you upset that I'm looking at getting rid of a dog, Hazzy? Yeah, I like dogs. You're like, you're like oh, but I want the dog. I sometimes, I a lot of times roll with two dogs, usually, in my group. Really? Yeah. You're just dogging it out. Wonder if I can do a whole party with just dogs in me. <laughs> just just dog party? Hey, well, I mean, except for my main I character. Wonder, I wonder if that counts. You know how they have the, the, like, go solo? I wonder if that counts as being solo. No, I don't think it does. But there is an achievement oh. for if you do it with all animals. There is? Yep. Mm. Somebody's been preparing, I can tell. All right, so yes, we're going to... We're going to hang on to the dog for now. I'm hoping I'll recruit a local. We'll try to do it that way. Anyways, let's select our expedition. Oh, yeah, can we can we finance? No, we can't. All right, we're not able to do any financing. Trials and, tri tri trials and triangulations. It's going with trials and tribulations. So, we got another survey measurement. Go ahead and select the same sponsor. Because we got them at rank 11 and we're trying to get even further. Alright, here's our night out. I spent the evening at the tavern thinking about the marvels of Paris. Jewel Parnell asked what I was most looking forward to on my next expedition. And discover places, treasure, local cuisine. That's actually, you know, if I'm going to be honest, I would kind of lean a little bit into that. Or exotic cultures. Actually, we're going with exotic cultures this time because I want to meet some new people. Parnell smiled and asked whether I had been to the human exhibitions in Paris already. I was not sure how I felt about this. We spent the evening discussing other cultures. Play anchor. So this is probably where we're going to run across the people who are enslaving other people. And, and you have to, like, you can try to convince them stuff, but we'll find out. Hey, from our war chest, we got two throwing axes. That's nice. Alright, so, among the cheap stuff this time, um, have to sur survey the location. So we, we want this. Um, these are dirt cheap, so let's load up. We'll get, um, we'll get a couple for climbing the plateaus. And then we need to load up on chocolate, I think. Seem reasonable to you? Yes. Chocolate's always reasonable. Chocolate and whiskey. Those are like the two we, most we, important we, things. What, what, what's Hazzy up to in her spare time? Chocolates and whiskey. All right. Or, actually, no, fresh lemonade is. Lemonade's the same price, okay. But it gives you 20 sanity. Yeah, I know, but I always go with whiskey. <laughs> it's cheaper, I think. I don't remember. Was it cheaper? <laughs> um, lemonade is ten. Oh, maybe lemonade's cheaper. Is there something? It As does like, less I always of? go with whiskey. Damn it! I just always usually go with whiskey. I think too. I start thinking, what if I come across a mission? Mm -hmm. And you know, they booze it up over there. Oh, they do. They booze it up. In... All right. Um. I kind of, I kind of want to uh, get a little bit more sanity stuff. I kind of feel like I'm, I'm cutting it close.
Let's hope. This is we're, we're going on a wing and a prayer or, or something here. Let's hope I find let's hope I find some locals to be able to to spend some time with. That'll help. All right, scientists from Lux Labs have noticed strange medi magnetic disturbances on this island. I was to take measurements from several key points to gather data for analysis, much like the previous one. All right, come on, get a good landing. Don't like land way out in the middle of nowhere. Don't don't make us go straight up rocks either. I said don't make us go straight up rocks. <sighs> it happens. Okay, so first off, oh, we got a promotable doggy. Promote doggy! What did you just say? Is he is he grumpy that I promoted the dog? <laughs> All right. Um, let's go ahead and zap somebody. So you are four, you are two, and you are four. So we're gonna zap the corporal. I always promote the dog before the people. Well, I'm not planning on keeping the dog very long. Aww. All right. I'm just being <laughs> honest. And I'm just being honest. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead. We'll get over to here. Um, hopefully, this will be a decent location. With hey, um, we can possibly get some old stuff. Come on, good rolls. I approach the remains of an old campsite, apparently once erected by a failed expedition. I felt a sense of foreboding as I glanced over the remains. We will search the camp. Our chances of getting blue is crap. We. This is why I was like, I need to get more blue dice. Why I was thinking of hiring that other person. I should have done that. Should have done that. All right. Well, we at least need to get a green. RN Jesus, please. Well, we got a green. Hey, it's better than nothing. Mm -hmm. Despite the sense of foreboding, I decided to search the camp thoroughly. After a short time, I found something of value amidst the remains. Oh my god, lots of therapy paddles. Great. We're, we're gonna get therapeutic up in here. <laughs> Time to move on. Um... I'm concerned... Cause I, I wanna I wanna get over and explore this stuff, but uh yeah, let's just let's just run let's do a straight run at it. Hopefully this wasn't a giant mistake. Infected. Um we're gonna have to deal with it. They had become inflamed. Um we need to We need to heal him. Alright, he uh, he no longer has an infected wound. Let's see how he's looking. Okay, yeah, he's fine. Speaking of which, since he does better with a gun, we're going to go ahead and give that to him. All right. Well, we're going to approach the waterfall here, though. So that was that was worth finding. We have a place to rest. That evening, Corporal Richard Barnell pointed at a heavy boulder and loudly proclaimed that it was much too heavy to lift. If successful, I would surely gain his respect. But would I really prevail? Well, I just gotta roll one red. There we go. I'm gonna earn your respect. My muscles were burning, but I was proud of my success. Corporal Richard Parnell patted me on the back and would this would secure his loyalty. So now we should have a uh, four out of four loyalty. Nice. All your people are always loyal. That's not like what I... I mean, we barely... I don't even zap people. I just kind of let them be. And then I wait until I can get, like, a medal to get, you know, those things to... Those necklaces to give them. Mm -hmm. And then that's how I try to get their loyalty. But I don't zap people, usually. I like the... I like your... I don't even zap people. All right. I just kind of deal with consequences when they're loyalty services. But it hasn't... That does not work out very well for me a lot of times. We're going around... We're gonna go interact with these people. Oh, 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 stop traveling, over here. Um, approach the shrine. We can um, hope for some luck here. All right, it's one of the purple fog ones. Search for secrets, we need to get 
one green at a bare minimum, two for a bonus. We can do that. We can do it. See? I have faith. As my hand ran over a rough surface to a wall, a string of arcane runes flared to life, seeming to carve themselves into the stone before my very eyes. I'm examining the writing. I studied the writing, my mind becoming strangely focused. I found myself speaking words I had never heard before, changing their strange song against my will. And I get lost consciousness briefly. When I came to, an inner glow diffused my being. I got blessing of healing. Okay. Well, that's, that's something. I decided I should leave the shrine before I caused irreparable harm and quickly departed. So, what is the healing thing? Um, blessing of healing. Wounds will never infect and regenerate much quicker. Health regeneration. Cool. That's a really nice one. That is pretty nice. That could, that could have dealt with the infection that I just had to deal with a little while ago. If you have a dog, I think you don't have to deal with loyalty with an animal. No, you do not. So, I mean, that's another positive about having animals. Mm -hmm. Certainly is. All right. I'm going to approach the islanders. When the islanders here first caught sight of us, they seemed terribly shaken. After a moment, they began to bow to us, one after the other. We proclaim ourselves a god. We would have to roll two. Um, I don't like ignoring their behavior, though. It seems very rude. Yeah, but can you make that roll? Very unlikely. Yeah, so you might... I mean, if you want to... If you want RNG, but... Embarrassed by the attention, I tried to downplay their awe and behave as normally as possible. They seemed surprised by my mundane reaction. Initial impressions fell aside as we learned to communicate better. I tried to decide on my next course, or my next action before moving on. Okay, we need to know about their village. They told me of the near settlement, giving me details, um, detailed directions for the route. I thanked them and carefully updated my map. Our business done, the islanders wished the spirits to treat me kindly as I continued on my journey once more. Okay, so it's all the way over there. Um, we can do this. Can do this. Do this. What were you and, doing? <laughs> um, we're going to their village. So, um, let's go ahead and we'll... Another sanity thing. We gotta make it over there, so... Maybe we can offer a gift to this group to be able to get some... No, Pixies! No! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Watch out for Pixies. Oh, they took our therapy paddles! They took one of our therapy paddles. You don't know how many times I ran into those thinking they were butterflies and then found out that they weren't? Yeah, really? Yeah. Oh, uh, that's, that's not fun. I met some islanders who seemed to be very agitated. Their companion had fallen down a hole and they couldn't get him out. So they begged us for help. We're going to help them. We just got to roll one game. There. With combined forces, we were able to pull up the beleaguered man. The islanders thanked me with exuberance and wished me further safe travels. Well, that got us some standing. That's not bad. At the bottom of the pit, something lay gleaming. The islander had fallen into a treasure trove. We shared the valuables before we uh, went our separate ways. We got some silver figurines. They Do they have any function? Nope. They're just um, for trade and stuff. All right, so let's go ahead and go over here. We'll be able to play our phonograph again here. What is this? Stone disc. Came across an ancient disc of carved stone embedded in the ground. Something about its strange markings made a nervous thrill run along my spine. I'm going to analyze them. And um, let's try to reveal what's going on over here. Okay, that's pretty good. And then we should be able to just get into town. We're going to have to make some trades to be able to get... Up going. 